this woman to this man in marriage? I do. Okay. Good evening. On behalf of Jessica and Stu, I'd like to welcome you and thank you for being here on this very special day among close friends and family. We've gathered here to rejoice in one of life's greatest moments and to give recognition to the worth and splendor of love. We see it in the faces of Stu and Jessica, and we experience it in our hearts as well. It's a love which is spoken of in all religions and all cultures, throughout all time and all places. It is our true home, our one meeting place, and it kindles our soul with hope. This ceremony is a tribute to this couple's companionship and mutual respect. It symbolizes their wonderful commitment to honor their differences, while also merging their most deeply held common values. You've all been invited here because Jessica and Stu deeply value their relationships in life and have asked those with whom they feel closest to join them in the celebration of their life together. Now, gently squeeze the hands that you are holding. Think about how precious they are to you. These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you. These are the hands that will work alongside of yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will hold you and comfort you when fear or grief try to overwhelm you. These are the hands that will hold your family together as one. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And these are the hands that even when wrinkled with age will provide the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. So remember this moment in time, there'll be plenty of pictures, it won't be hard, but while this is not the beginning of your journey together through life, the words that you are about to speak will take you across the threshold and you will continue your journey united as husband and wife. Stu, you come here before this gathering of friends and family to proclaim your love and devotion for Jessica. You promise to love and support her through all of life's changes. You promise communication and to always remember that this is a partnership. You commit yourself to being faithful to her and caring for her during times of joy and hardship and you promise to honor her growth and freedom as well as your own. With this as the vision you are entering into, do you now take Jessica to be your lawfully wedded wife for as long as you both shall live? I do. Jessica, you come here before this gathering of friends and family to proclaim your love and devotion for Stu. 
You promise to love and support him through all of life's changes. You promise communication and always to remember that this is a partnership. You commit to being faithful to him and caring for him during times of joy and hardship. And you promise to honor his growth and freedom as well as your own. With this as the vision you are entering into, do you now take Stu to be your lawfully wedded husband for as long as you both shall live? I do. Rings are an ancient symbol, blessed, simple, and round, like the sun, like the eye, like the arms that embrace. For love that is given comes round and round again. May these rings remind you that your love, like the sun shines brightly, that your love, like the eye sees clearly, and that your love, like arms that embrace, truly is a gift to our world. Stu, place the ring on Jessica's left hand and repeat after me. <laughs> it is. I, Stu, take you, Jessica. I, Stu, take you, Jessica. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or poorer. For richer or for poorer. And in sickness and in health. And in sickness and in health. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to love you unconditionally. To support you in your goals. To support you in your goals. To honor and respect you. To honor and respect you. To laugh with you and cry with you. To laugh with you and cry with you. And to cherish you. And to cherish you. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. Now, Jessica, invested with the same significance as the ring you have just received, a circle of precious metal indicating the longevity of your love and the pricelessness of your devotion, place this ring on Stu's left hand and repeat after me. I, Jessica, take you, Stu, to be my wedded husband. I, Jessica, take you, Stu, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or poorer. For richer or poorer. And in sickness and in health. And in sickness and in health. I promise to love you unconditionally. I promise to love you unconditionally. To support you in your goals. To support you in your goals. To honor and respect you. To honor and respect you. To laugh with you and cry with you. To laugh with you and cry with you. And cherish, uh, cherish you. And cherish you. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. You may now kiss the bride. They say sometimes things gotta break for the sunlight to come in all that you got you made me feel at home in a world i saw through the eyes of a girl you color everything in. They say they i'm sure i speak for all of us in saying how proud we are of these accomplishments for the two of them in this short amount of time and this is just the beginning. From the very start, it is obvious that they work well together, they travel well together, and live their lives together so well in every way. My little baby, she's like my whole heart. She was my baby before I had a baby, and she's still my baby. And you know, the only thing, there's nothing really that could make me happier than what we're all here for today, which is like this, which is my perfect little human that I love so much, marrying her perfect person. And I just know that they're just gonna like build this amazing, beautiful, fun life together. And I'm so happy for her and I'm so happy for the both of you. And I'm so glad Stu that you're coming to our family and that your family is joining our family because um, it's just, it's so wonderful. So cheers, I love you both so much. Cheers to Jess and Stu, happily ever after. Love you. And now not only are you an MD, but you're tops in your class, you're chief resident, 
There are a bunch of other awards that I don't know what they mean, but I think they're in Latin. And seriously, could not be more proud of you. All right. In closing, Stu and Jess, you guys are quite the power couple. And as mentioned, one that I really look up to. And also one that Ants and I aspire to be. You guys are both amazing human beings. And the way you've handled the adversity from COVID is unbelievable. You are out on the front lines. You've been serving patients. And on top of that, you managed to plan and reschedule your wedding, not once, not twice, but three times, while also managing a cross-country move and now the upcoming deployment. And anyone else would have reason to mope, pout, or feel sorry for themselves, but you guys have been cool, calm, and collected, been nothing but happy and optimistic, and just like Jess in the face of the kitchen fire, one cool cucumber.